Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be doing a reaction video on an MTV that is called Meto Udumara. The production house is by Musky Flims and the song is made by Rapstar Cloda featuring Noko. Now the title itself, I did some research and the title which is called Meto Udumara actually means uh, the flower that is sent by the heavens. It's a Sanskrit word and it has a very nice poetic touch to it. So I hope uh, the song is good as the title. So let's get on with the reaction video. And shout out to Rapstar Cloda and Noko and Musky Flims. Thank you for having me. All right. <clears throat> hmm. White sneakers and there's the girl. Okay, stop. So first of all, uh, I feel like most of the MTVs do this, like there's always a girl and there's, a, there's gonna be a boy. I know there's gonna be a boy and they're gonna be like falling in love or something. It's always like this same plot over and over again. I'm not against it. I mean, most of the MTVs, they do that, uh, but I am looking for something really new and I hope this is not I hope this is not the common ones, but I think this will be the common ones. So let's get on to it again. Okay, so we have the girl. They're in a forest, I don't know why. And there's the boy. Oh, why did I see this coming? Why did I see this coming? Like, there's always a boy and a girl, and I'm sure this is a romantic song too, uh, judging by the title itself. But, okay, so, I'm not gonna be too judgy on this, but let's, uh, let's see how this goes. Let's see how this goes, and let's see how the song is. <clears throat> nice jacket, by the way. Okay, she, she slaps his finger, they disappear. I'm not getting the plot a little bit. I'm confused with the plot. First of all, I don't know why they're in the forest. And second of all, uh, they just click the hang. Is it like a dream or some sort? Um, I guess they were playing around with the visuals and the plot, but okay. Here comes the lyrics. Here comes the lyrics. Let's go. Yomo udumara buni gisem kara gupsiru chera in dena bumche di atara ni mitse chigere wazere bumche ra in chitomi nimne gutsu nisem chilo shuai si baby ma chilo ka. Oh. Ah. Uh. I'll I'll give you like I'll give like seven out of ten for the lyrics. It's a it, it's catchy. It's catchy. It's really nice, and I think like uh, people can sing along with it. And yeah, like the so far of the rap, I've uh, I feel like uh, it hasn't got there yet. I'm looking for something more out of this rap. I hope there's more to this rap. Like, but I like the lyrics. It's nice. It's catchy. Uh, so let's uh, let's get on to it. I hope there's something more to this. Okay. Loving Annie is a girl that you never mm. seen. You make my feelings down, girl. You make my heart go bleed. Mm. Sometimes I scream, but it is good that you give to me. Okay. No matter circumstances, just between you and me, I love you. Okay, so why do I feel he's much better with? rapping in English rather than rapping in Zonka. I don't know, like the flow just like go, like it's much better. Like I'll give you like, I'll give him like seven out of 10 when he raps in Zonka, but like I'll give him like uh, 8.5 out of 10 if he is rapping in English. I feel like he's more comfortable in English, but yeah. Okay, so le uh, let's see this. Wait, wait, what? Uh, wait. The lyrics, uh, did I catch that right? Wait. No matter what I loved you hundred times in a thousand different ways. Hmm. That right there is a bit confusing for me, but I guess anything goes, I suppose. <laughs> but yeah, okay. Uh, how do you love a girl hundred times in a thousand different ways? If you, if you love... If you love if you love somebody in a hundred ways, then I guess it's like hundred times. But ah, I'm so bad at maths. 
but okay, okay, I'm not be, gonna be too judgy. Let's uh, let, so much for the plot. Um, so much for the plot. I feel like uh, they could have done more to it, but uh, I guess they had to stick with the common uh, common uh, plot where there's always a guy and a boy, and they somehow like have an infatuation relationship and like. You know, the girl is like this uh, princess of some sort, but uh, I guess it goes with the title because it's uh, it's called Meto Udumara. It Meto Udumara, so I'm guessing the girl is the flower that is sent by the heavens, and these two singers are trying to woo her or something. But okay, uh, not gonna be too judgy on this. Uh, let's. Uh, I like the lyrics. I like the lyrics. The song is good. It's catchy. But I felt like they could have done more with the plot. Um, but oh well, let's uh, let's get on. No, I can't explain that it lines with the rhymes. But my heart says you're always in my mind. I like that. I like that lyrics. Uh, go back. No, I can't explain that it lines with the rhymes. No, I can't explain though it rhymes with the lines. Ooh, that's kind of ooh, that's kind of catchy. Ooh. Okay. I don't know why, like, when she walks right there, uh, I feel like she looks very awkward and doesn't know what to do. But, okay, let's go, let's go. I like the rap, man, I like the rap. Oh. So I'm guessing that's Noko. Oh. 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 Mm. Yeah, it's it's catchy. It's, it goes with the flow. It goes with the rhymes, and. Uh, like like all MTVs and like all most of the Bhutanese songs, it's about uh, love. It's about romance, um, something we are all used to. But uh, like I'm looking for something new. But yeah, like this also works for me, I suppose. Hmm. I don't know why, like, uh, I give, I feel like, um, I feel like on the rap part, Cloda is, Cloda has potential, like, he has a lot of potential, it seems, but I feel like this is not his best work, I, I will completely agree with, uh, with like, I don't, I feel like he can do much better than this song. Like, I feel he has that potential. Hmm. Now I like that. Um, you see, there's a scene where the, both the guys are wearing sunglasses, but when Clodo wears the sunglasses, it's outside, okay? Now that makes sense. Maybe uh, I'm too skeptical about it, but like, <laughs> when Noko wears the sunglasses, it's inside the room and they're lot. Maybe it's because of the lights, I don't know. But I found it like, that was, uh, I found it a bit un unnecessary for him to be wearing sunglasses. I found him like, I don't know, like, uh, in terms of props, like they just, I think like they just used it, whatever they could find. But I felt like that wasn't needed there, for some reason. I can understand why Clodagh is wearing the, you know, the sunglasses. Mm. How you been, girl? Couple days I don't see. Hit me up if you miss, girl. I'll be free. I saw you in my dream that you were princess and I'm prince. Shout out, you my love to my last okay. breath. I'm gonna rule this out. Definitely, if you Clodo raps in English, he sounds much better. Like I feel like so something's missing when he so like raps in Zonka. But uh, I know some facts that uh, Clodo actually participated in Bhutan Idol and he rapped in Zonka and he got into the top ten. So props to that and shout out to that. It was amazing to see him grow as a young star and. Uh, 
I think he stood against. Uh, he got knocked out in the top seven, and he stood seventh place. But uh, yeah,、um, I feel like he's he can do much better in English. I don't know why, but even in Zonka, he sounds he sounds fine. He sounds fine. But like I feel like he's more confident in this video. Basically, in this song, I feel like he's more confident in English. You the only one, you you can do. Je ero meru, you you do it na na. You my one and only. You say I'm gonna be with you tomorrow, che. Je beto with you tomorrow, buni ke do it na. Je to me ni mlo ke to shi me put jab kara. Je he mala me tam tu gara ni ke do it na ra. La to lungi jab lo. Again with the plot, I'm almost coming to the end of the video, and the plot kinda makes no sense to me right now. It's just, it's like I think they're just describing their idol girl, like what kind of girl they want. Well, the plot, like the title itself, says the flower that was sent by the heavens. So I guess they want a girl that's like something like that. <laughs> But okay, okay, let's go. Let's end this. It's catchy. It's catchy. And that's it, huh? All right. I suppose that's the end of it all.、Uh, thank you for watching my video.、Uh, before I end this video.、Uh, Shout out to Rapstar Cloda and Noko and Musky Flims. They did a fine, fantastic job. But、uh, I don't know, like these vi- music videos. They, the reason I don't do much、uh, reaction on these music videos is because most of them are so common, and I feel like the plot was common here, but、uh, the visuals were good, the lyrics were catchy, and、uh, but I have to say, I have to be honest. I feel like this is not their best work. They have a lot of potential to be doing,、uh, to do much more. But I feel like this is not their best work. But in terms of everything, I rate rate this around like seven out of ten. All right. Thank you for watching my video, and see you soon on the next episode.